Okay, so that's not a UFO. That is just a... Uh, I think that's one, one of those... Uh, you know, varmint fucking uh, things I got plugged in the wall and, you know, keep varmints away. Sonic. So this Warlock uh, Black video is about... Because I look good, but I just want to be in bed and do this video. But I, it's about some technical issues relating to Warlocks and Witches. Uh, a lot of people think, you know, it's about good and evil and all this shit. They fucking don't even know what they're talking about. To have powers like this, you can't be uh, having weird disturbances within the planet zone. The zone and the planet, there's warlocks for Earth, there's warlocks outside Earth, and they, extensions of warlocks past that. And they just, you know, they, they have improvements uh, concerning the circumstances that surround them. So, an extraterrestrial, vastly superior, mostly because it's just a higher level version of a warlock. But we also have to have power here on Earth to protect, uh, you know, everyone. And, and the witches do the same thing. Now, um, witches are not, by proxy, like evil or good or anything. They're just, they do what they have to do, like a, mil like a, a unit. And if you will, they are very good at this military aspect of being a warlock, which is fighting uh, warlocks that want to create, you know, throw sticks in the spokes of the uh, machine. So, just get it straight. Warlocks and witches, we work in the same way. Now, one thing about witches is, witches, and sorry if you hear that fan in the background, I'm going to get some cooler air up here. Witches are um, just as powerful a warlock, it, with the exception of they cannot overthrow a warlock. So, they can do just the same things that we can, they're just not allowed to fuck with warlocks. And there's a cap on women's power for that reason. Uh, when we were created, we had to have uh, some kind of balance within the procreation uh, array. Another thing about witches is, um, or I'm sorry, uh, in relation to power and struggle is, like I've told this before, a warlock isn't allowed to fucking fix his body. I know it sounds like a <laughs> you know, bullshit chime or whatever to say that, but... You know, we're not supposed to stand out and get killed by the kings of the years past and so forth. Like that. So I'm a whistleblower, warlock. I'm allowed to do it because we're in a modern age of concern. So I'm allowed to do this. Okay, uh, I've been given permission. I'm the only warlock out of 12 uh, warlocks uh, that are in command. Um, the witches... Um, uh, you know, because, we, you know, they're... There's a lot of false things said about women, like there's some divine female and shit. Uh, they're only divine in the fact that they were created to create more humans. So <laughs> it's the same with the men in a lot of ways, but the men have been making society go by for most of the time. Women have contributed in the physical linear aspect of time throughout history. Um, um, now, humans actually have more power than a witch or a warlock in the sense that, well, they're supposed to actually look like they're creating scenarios for warlocks and or witches. Like, let's say somebody gets literally straight up killed in front of you. The warlock transists into another vessel very quickly. And all of a sudden, he's doing the same job. That's a protection meth you know, method that the creators designed for us. It's a mechanism of their own design. They did that so that it would look like in this linear aspect of time that the whoever or whatever got destroyed, and he, you know, whether he was to be noticed as somebody special or not. So, um, in the same sense, uh, Jesus was killed. Jesus is a transhuman genetic uh, cyborg. That means he was created from more or less a. Uh, uh, he's been uh, synthesized so that he can also reanimate and dissolve and reanimate, like just like we do, but he's a, a, more or less a higher form of warlock, same thing. There's no real difference. They terraform this area. They have to have protocols like that of safety. Can't have bio slabs running around through space anyway. It's too dangerous. So uh, Elon Musk, good luck with that. They travel within uh, dimensional confines and scenarios that are synthetically developed, kind of like uh, you would create sounds from a synthesizer, 
But uh, just to make a point about it, uh, humans can, within the time frame of linear aspect, that is uh, what we, our expectations as humans are when we begin, and that would include me and witches as well, they all start as humans, is that they don't, um, you know, they don't want people to know that you're super powerful. So what they do is they make humans look, other humans, mankind, look like they're affecting all kinds of shit when really... No, it's just a dog and pony show to keep everyone kind of like thinking that there's no one more powerful than them or some shit. You know, give them some weird ego trip, which is fine because that en enables them to feel comfortable with continuing living. Anyway, so just to make a point, that's not a UFO. Uh, no pause, Clark out.